We have learned about solutions as a mixture of two or more substances in the same phase. It involves a solute dissolving in a solvent. But some substances simply do not want to associate with one another. As an example, when oil and water are added together, they form two distinct layers. This is because they are immiscible with one another. In other words, they do not mix. Even if you shake these two liquids vigorously, they will still remain immiscible. Let us look closely at what we have right now. There are tiny oil droplets interspersed throughout the water. We have just created an emulsion. What do you think will happen if we let this emulsion stand for 5 to 10 minutes? Let's pause the video and have a think. Press play once you are done. Since oil and water are immiscible, the oil droplets will reform the original layer. Common everyday emulsions include milk, mayonnaise, ice cream, and paint. These emulsions are mostly oil droplets in water. Emulsions can also exist as water droplets in oil. Real life examples include margarine, lotions, and facial creams. The world's most popular emulsion is, without a doubt, ice cream. The main ingredients are milk or cream and sugar, along with flavoring and coloring components. So what prevents an emulsion, such as ice cream, from separating? Substances known as emulsifiers are added to stabilize emulsions. When making ice cream, egg yolk is commonly added. The active emulsifier in egg yolk is called lecithin. Too little lecithin will cause the ice cream to separate, and too much will ruin its texture and flavor. All emulsifiers have two components, a hydrophilic or water-loving head and a hydrophobic or water-fearing tail. If we added lecithin to our original oil and water emulsion, its hydrophilic head will prefer to associate with water and the hydrophobic tail with the oil droplets. This prevents separation and thus stabilizes the emulsion. In summary, an emulsion is a mixture of two substances that are immiscible with one another. These emulsions can be stabilized by adding emulsifiers.